hello everyone today I want to explain you how to prepare your computer for setting up and use the HP Tensile software at first connect the USB flash that sent for you with the machine to your computer open it and you will see all the files and programs that you need to use for your Tensile machine including HP Tensile setup RS-485 converter driver, lab view and DSC module software, and connection and calibration files, and data. Before installing and running the AHP Tensile software, you need to install lab view and DSC module that we will explain you how to do it in another instruction file. After that, we must set up the RS-485 converter driver. Insert the USB port of the converter to your computer. And now, open device manager. Here. Go to port section and you will see a new serial port here. For installing the driver, go to your USB flash copy the driver folder in your drive D Extract it. And open it. Here is the folder. and install the program easily that way okay your converter is ready to use and the device is updated click on finish button after that from device manager right click on USB serial port click properties a window will open from the port settings tab adjust the parameters to the values you see here bits per second 9600 data bits to 7 parity even stop bits to 1 and flow control on and then click on advance button and change the COM port number to COM 10 click OK OK again OK go back to your USB flash click on HP tensile folder choose my installer then double click on volume and then set up it install the software <coughs> easily by clicking some next button and then finish Now, copy tensile delta to your drive D of your computer and extract it.
Now open the HP Tensile program. Let me some uh, let me say some note here. The USB flash is a hardware lock for your software and it must be connected when you want to use. You see, I disconnected the flash from the computer uh, and the hardware lock is unplugged. Error has been shown to you on the display. So, connect the USB flash to your computer and then open HP Tensile program again. From the right bottom side in your windows, here, click on NI OPC servers. Click on open button. Go to drive D. Open tensile delta folder. OPC tensile.opf file then right click on channel 1 and click on properties in the communications tab here you will see the converter settings that must be set to COM10 bound rate 9600 data bits 7 parity even stop bits 1 and flow control none then click ok click on OPC icon here and you will see that your converter is connected to the computer and working from Close the OPC program. And then open HP Tensile software again. Click on quit. And then run again. After that, a file with name tension one has been made on your uh, drive D. Let me check it together. This file tension one dot that has been made. Go to your USB flash. and copy and replace the tension one file to your drive D. We click on copy, we go back to drive D, paste here and push the copy and replace button. This file is calibration values of your machine that says for your software reads uh, the data from this file. Okay. We're done here in this video and in the next video we will teach you how to use the program and options and software setting you need for tensile test.